What is up, YouTube? Uh, there's a reason why I got my camera backwards right now. Um, hopefully y'all can see my face. I can't see it. But, uh, there is a reason to this. So, I am about to buy something. Not today. I already have the money for it today. But, that's all I got right now is the money. Uh, so I don't want to buy it just yet. Uh, I want to wait till my next paycheck whenever I have more than just the money because I, I don't like sp spending money and not having money. Um, because what happens if I need something? Um, and I have no way to get what I need. Especially something I need to live, like food or water, uh, or a place to sleep. Uh, so I won't wait till my next paycheck to buy it, but I already have the money for it. I already talked to dude about it. My paycheck is Wednesday, so yeah. Um, but let me turn this camera around so y'all can see what I'm about to buy. It's a little bit dirty right now, but hey. He's currently getting it completely repaired. Uh, he's got the... Um, this is... I believe it is a 97 um, model, and it is a Ford Ranger. No, not Ranger. Uh, is it a Ranger? Yeah, I believe it's a Ranger. Looks pretty nice on the inside. But there's a few things I'm going to do to it. I'm not. I won't wait till he's got it all fixed up. Um. Even after I buy, it, he's still going to fix it up completely. I know this dude. He ain't going to screw me over. He's going to be sure it's right. And if not, he, he done said that. He'd hook me up. But there's a few things I want to do to it. One, I want to replace these. Uh, for a set of uh, 44 inch mud grippers. I want to get a 3 inch lift. Um, obviously I want to clean it up real good. Get all this dirt off. Give it a clean paint job. I'm going to go for the same color, just new. Um, next thing is, is interior is pretty nice, ain't too bad. Um, but I want to lift that up. Get it on some 44s, 3 inch lift. Um, next thing I want to do is just extend the bed. I want to get an extended bed for it. I'm not a big fan of short beds, so replace this out. I like stuff that can haul a lot of stuff and carry some weight. Uh... Because one of the things I do, not as a full-time job, it's like a side gig. I, I do a lot of brick work and fence work and stuff like that. Uh, help people out, make a little bit of cash on the side. Uh, so, yeah, I, I like plenty of room in the trunk to haul stuff in. 
And then aside from the paint job, lifting it and the bed, um, that's pretty much it. Uh, I would like to get some new lights for it, some bright lights. And get a, a roof mount light set. That'd be nice for it. And a um, winch. I need a winch. Other than that, this truck's all good. Um, and hopefully, it is a manual. I have hardly any experience driving manual, so I would have to take it on a dirt road and test it out, turn around a few times, drive, turn around, drive, uh, just to kind of get the hang of it. Um, because I've never drove manual before. I drove my brother's manual. I did pretty good at it. Um, so I have a little bit of experience, but not enough to actually get out on the road. Um, my brother taught me how to drive his manual a little bit. Um, but I still don't trust myself in it until I actually get a little bit more practice in. Um... Hopefully, I can get updates on it, show y'all how it's coming along. Um, maybe kind of film the progress if I can, I don't know. Uh, probably won't be able to, just because most of the time I won't be around when it's being repaired. Hey... I just realized what this had in it. That's a V6. That's an old engine, but it's it's a good engine too. Uh I don't think they make V6s anymore. I think uh I believe they're still making V8s. But I think they're pretty much down to um they're doing V12 right now. I don't think they make V6s anymore. But it's a good engine. Um, has a bit of power behind it. But yeah. Uh, that's a truck currently being fixed up right now. Uh, so, it's not one I'm buying, it's one that the dude's fixing up for one of the other people. Uh, dude, I'm buying that from the one over there that I just showed y'all. His name's John, a different dude owns this truck. This dude, like, works at cars from his home. He, he gets, he gets paid pretty well for it, too. He don't cheat people over. He gives, them. Um, what, about what their money's worth. Um, he obviously he has you pay for the parts. Most mechanics do that. You pay for the parts, but most mechanics they're also like you'd very well pay about two hundred for or about four hundred for three hours worth of work, and he's about uh, he he's a bit cheaper than that. Uh, he's about a hundred or so, sixty-five to a hundred, depending on what he has to do, which is pretty reasonable. And gets the job done. He don't. He don't quit until. It's done even if it takes him like weeks. He, he'll still. Because obviously he has a lot of. Mainly trucks out here. People ask him to fix up their trucks all the time. He's got a few cars back there. That he's been fixing up. Um, That's his truck that he keeps all his tools in. 
Um, so yeah, it takes him a while to get to some of these just because he's got other cars they works on and other vehicles. But he ain't going to overcharge you. He, he only charges you for the time that he spends on that one vehicle. If it takes him an hour, but he don't get it done for several weeks, he ain't going to charge you for those several weeks. He's going to charge you for that one hour that he did that in. I'm going to go ahead and get off here, though.